Title, North Korea Throws Shade at U.S. Diplomatic Dance with China. TLDR, so North Korea's got some feelings to share, folks. They've got their troll hats on and they're taking aim at U.S. Secretary of State, Anthony Blinken's recent Beijing soiree. Tagging it as a begging trip, the Hermit Kingdom suggests the U.S. is desperate and seeking a bailout from China. Ain't no party like a diplomatic party, because a diplomatic party gets roasted by North Korea, apparently. Anthony Blinken, U.S. Secretary of State, recently touched down in Beijing, presumably expecting some sweet and sour diplomacy with China. But it seems the trip didn't go unnoticed by the ever-watchful eyes of North Korea. North Korea has straight up called Blinken's visit a begging trip. Harsh words from a nation known for its, let's say, unique approach to foreign relations. It's almost like watching your buddy roast someone at a party, and you're not sure whether to laugh or hide in the punch bowl. According to North Korean media outlets, the U.S. is in trouble and is begging for cooperation from many countries, especially China. Is this accurate, or just another chapter in the book of international banter? Who knows? Now, the U.S.-China relationship is a complex one. On the one hand, they're kind of like those two competitive friends you have, they're always bickering, always trying to one-up each other, but ultimately, they need each other. This, apparently, is an angle North Korea is having a field day with. One thing's for sure, it's far from a bromance. There's competition, rivalry, a little name-calling, and, let's be honest, some pretty big egos in play. And like any good drama, we've got a keen audience watching from the sidelines. In this case, North Korea, the popcorn muncher extraordinaire. But here's the catch. While this might seem like just another tongue-in-cheek jab from North Korea, it does beg the question, what is their actual intention behind these statements? Are they just trying to stir the pot, or is there a more strategic play at hand? North Korea is notorious for its unpredictable diplomacy, if you can call it that. It's like that wildcard friend who keeps the group chat spicy. You never know what they're going to say next. But could their comments about the US-China visit be aimed at more than just getting a few laughs? Could they be intending to sow discord between the two countries or seeking to manipulate perceptions? No matter what, this story serves as a reminder that international diplomacy is never just black and white. It's a world of intrigue, manipulation, and, yes, even a little bit of humor. But let's get real for a moment. Is this just North Korea being North Korea, trying to grab headlines and keep us entertained? Or is there something more to their seemingly playful trolling? What do you think, readers, is North Korea playing a deeper game here, or just spicing up the international diplomatic scene? With a dash of sass? Over to you.